BCB, not an easy course with all that new snow recently and uh, some ruts, but you did, a, you did a good job. Let's check it out. Ben, you second run, take up. Ruts are tough, you know, you got to kind of ride it. Um, you try to get above it, but it's it's hard because it's... And, and to get inside it is really steep from the gate down to the rut. Uh, not easy. And there's going to be usually a, a little bit of a bump coming out, which you got thrown a couple times. But let's see. So you came in here. You know, kind of just lost that outside ski, though, right on the inside ski. Your feet widen right there. So, you know, you found you, you found the outside ski there. So, you know, as you will know, outside ski to outside ski. Uh, I think overall impression was, um, you know, your, some of your transitions are a little bit slow. And you've got to move to the new ski, and it's really hard. Um, if you don't have the right kind of a pole plan, pole plan just really helps the timing. Uh, helps speed up the transition, helps us get re-centered, re rebalanced, move to the new ski. Um, you can see here, pole plant like kind of like way behind you. All right, so a forward, more forward pole plant. Again, really steep along the inside of that rut, but you did a good job there. Um, you know, clearing. You know, it's. You really want to clear with the pole more, um, a little bit, well, you know, horizontal to the hill, that's for sure, and not down like that, and the tip a little bit more forward of your hand, and then all you got to do is just, after you clear the gate, drop it to the ground. It's really a tap more than a plant, and because you're... You're clearing with your pole and you know, kind of down this way. It, it makes it difficult. And we don't want to push the, oh, this is an under, but we also don't want to push the gate down. Because once you push the gate down, we're really in no position. You got to raise the hand back up to pole plant. The pole plant's late. Transition's a little bit slow. That's, a that's how you want to clear it, right there. That is perfect on where you want your ski pole to be clearing. Tip higher than the hand. I can't see, but the tip, tip should be forward of the hand, but in that position. And we just come down, and it's a little slow. We could really drop that quicker. Now, we mentioned, or I mentioned, uh, you know, there's usually a bump coming out of some ruts, and we got to be really be absorbing them and be ready for them. Yeehaw! Uh, I don't think you were ready for that one, but you did a great job landing it, and didn't really didn't seem like it slowed you down, but it can. Here we are again in the air, jumping around. This is a good one. This is the old, uh, you know, face block. You know, I love the whiplash going on there. Let's check that one out again. Boom, boom, boom. Oh yeah, face block. It's a, it's a, it's a. Um, you know, all the World Cup guys practice it. You know, that's a nice one. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> yeah, you kind of missed that gate, I guess. Again, pull. You know, down, going down here when you clear. It looks like the more on your right side is going to be really tough to pull plant. There was zero pull plant there. Push the gate down. 
No chance to pull a plant. Oh, you pushed the gate down so much you fell over yourself, but that's beside the point. Good idea to clear another push the gate down. I mean, how could you pull a plant? Uh, can't. Pushing the gate down. Gates don't need to push down, man. You're, uh, although, you know, I'm not, not saying you're like, uh, you know, gigantic big dude, but uh, you're bigger, you're stronger than these poles. They flop down between your shin and your hand. You will push them down. They will flop down. Uh, you know, when, when, you know, when do you want to push them down? Not there. You know, towards the finish line when it's flat and straight. We don't really need that pole plant anymore. You can push them down there. Are you coming out of the gate, possibly? Possibly. If it's straight and flat up, you know, it depends on the start. But, you know, generally speaking, maybe on the way to um, the finish line, where it should be flatter, don't really need, may not need that pole plant. But, you know, not yeah, pushing them down. Now, you know, now... Now you're heading to the finish. This is okay. You don't, really, don't really need pole plant right now. Push him down. But not an easy course. I'd say the conditions were tough. Did a great job. I would say try to clear the gate with a, like we described, like I described, more of a ski pole, more horizontal, even up a little bit. Tip above your hand, tip in front of your hand, and then just drop it to the side with your wrist. The sooner you pole plant, the better. Help your transition. Get to the new ski. And then, of course, uh, you know, in ruts, be prepared for that um, bump coming out of the gate. And lastly, let's make, keep on working on the uh, the face block. It's uh, I think you're setting a trend here. Everyone's going to be doing it soon. But uh, nice job.